morning. Good morning. Good morning. Welcome to the Green Valley Parkinson's Support Group Exercise class. And welcome to those of you joining us online on YouTube. If it's your first time, um, you're going to need a straight back chair without arms and a pair of light hand weights and a tennis ball and a larger ball and some water. It's about a 45 minute class. We start in a seated position, then we'll be standing, then we come back in for cool down. So make sure that you have those things and that you have some room to stretch out. And I invite you to have a seat in your chair too. You need to come out here now. All right. It's Caribbean music. Yeah. So sitting forward in the chair with some space behind you, your feet flat on the floor and tall in the seat. Take a deep breath through the nose. And out through what we call pursed lips. Again, take a deep breath. And out. Bow the head, pressing the shoulders down. And then sit tall as you look up, relaxing your jaw, allowing your mouth to open slightly. And then center. Listen so that ear drops a little closer to the shoulder. Good morning, Trudy. Good morning. How are you doing? Good. Yeah. And then drop it forward again and circle the head. Look all around the room. The other way. Good. Chin to the chest and look up and stretch. And then we come back to a neutral position. Turn, focus on something about eye level, and then turn just your head, look over the other shoulder, good. And side to side, a little faster, getting some flexibility in the neck, and then nod the head up, down, up, down, good. And shoulders, let's roll those shoulders. See, you're not alone over there now. <laughs> no and change the direction, big circles. Good. And some shoulder shrugs, up and down, and up, down, up, and up, one more. The arms now to the side, the shoulders relaxed. Move your fingers, and then stretch the hands, and touch each one to the thumb. Big yarn. <laughs> Scratch, yeah, work your hands. And then make a tight fist. Pat, it's good to have you with us. And then relax. Let those out and circle. One, good. Two, Two three. Count with us. Four. Again. One, five, one, reverse it. Five, five four, four, three, two, one. one. And we end here as if we had a shelf and they're just resting there. But we don't. So we hold them up. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> circles, big circles. Don't hit your neighbor. Working your shoulders, good. And then the other way, big circles. And then we keep the arms reaching overhead. It's one, one and, and two, two. Use and that outdoor three voice. And four, four and, and one more. Five and and the arms just come back to that position like you're holding the walls back and then bring it in and one, out. One, two, two, three, four. four. Five. They come down, resting one on the chair for a side bend. Oh, good job. And then to the other side, stretch. Cross the arms, placing your hands on your shoulders, twisting the torso both directions. Oh, crap. That felt good. <laughs> and center. The arms uncross. The hands are here. This is a practice in shifting your weight. So it goes to one side and we lift the opposite hip. Up and two and three and four and one more. Five. Soon and take it into a march. Good. Sitting away from the back of the chair, sitting tall, knees up, and those arms moving. Keep in mind, it's just warm up. Yeah. And then we bring it back to the 
just starting position, the arms drop. We're sitting tall in the chair for some heel taps. Out with a straight leg, flexed foot, and three, and four, and one more, five. And we come back to this position. Rock the weight onto the ball of the foot and then the heel. Yeah. You're too close to the chair. It's kind of hard, isn't it, Mary? So I like to put them out here a little bit. Good. One up, one down. Good. And then both flat on the floor. Tall in the chair, the arms are dropped. Always know that those chair legs are there if you need them. Looking forward, extend one and lift it up and circle one. One, two, three, four, five. five reverse it. Five, five four, three, two, one. one. Back here, straight out with the other one, lift it up and circle. One, two, two three, three, four, five, five the other way. Five, four, three, three two, two, one. And that is warm up. So if you lean back a bit, you should not touch the back of the chair. So we have that much room to spare. We're going to start with a bicep curl. So locate those weights whatever you choose to use um, make sure that they challenge your muscles but um, don't compromise your good position so sit tall and that, that's not disposition that's position <laughs> <laughs> it could compromise that too i guess so the elbows tucked lift it up to the shoulder one, one two, two and we count three, three four, four nine five, five six, six Seven, eight, nine, ten. And then come back and you stretch and breathe, maybe a little deeper. And again, find that position where you're sitting tall, elbows tucked, and raise it. One, two, three, four, five, six, good, seven, eight, nine. Ten. Keep them, drop the arms to the side, grow two inches taller, yes, and then rotate the shoulders, arms, and weights forward, and then pull them back, pinching the shoulder blades together. Do, that's okay with you? Okay, good. All right. She has a little stiffness in the neck, so I said you be careful. So lift one up, tuck it, looking forward, finding that floor, good, and then come up. Waist management, work in that waistline. Good job, and there. Whew. We're gonna place both of them on the floor again. We'll pick them up in a minute. So we're gonna bring our feet from this good wide position to a much narrower position, compromising a bit of your balance. So make sure that you've got enough of that chair to sit on. Arms are crossed and the legs are out. Don't look down. Look out as you lift the feet and flex and point. Two, Two three, three, pull them back. Four, five, five keep going. Six, six seven, eight, nine, nine ten. ten. Flexed feet, the heels touch and the toes are out, One, in, two, out, in. Three, four, One five, more, reverse it, heels one, out. Two, three, four, five. And they come down separate the feet, uncross the arms, and out with one. And if you can keep that foot on the floor and still keep a straight leg, that's even better. We're working some flexibility in the ankle. So the hands cradle the knee, tall in the chair, as you slide those hands down, well, everybody has shorts on practically, down the leg and drop into the stretch. And come up. Good, bring that in, extending the other one. They slide down the side, reaching from the hip, drop into the stretch and take a deep breath. Beautiful, and up. Bring that in, first leg goes out again and the arms extend, fingers spread apart as you twist. Opposite hand reaches for the foot that's out there. The focus is on the foot that's out there. The other arm is reaching for the ceiling with an open hand. Good. And then come up and then we twist the other way. Same thing. Focus on the foot and reach for the ceiling. Good. And come up. 
the arms draw that leg comes in tall shoulders in line with hips reach for it and go down looking down at that foot beautiful and up good job and there And the arms drop the feet come right back into that position one way both hands we're gonna work the tricep muscle in our arms so fingers are wrapped and arms are straight up the shoulders so they're relaxed and the weight drops to the back elbows high one, one two, two nice and loud three, I like it four five six good seven eight so don't get rid of that. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Is there some yard sale going on that we don't know about? <laughs> we were not informed. All right, straight up, the shoulders relax, the weight to the back, raise it up, One, down, two, two, good, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, perfect, nine, nine ten. ten. Now we can put it down and take another break. Third position. We've gone from here to here, but now, Mary, we're gonna go here. So we're gonna open up at the hip, shifting weight a little bit, finding center, and the arms are out, placing one on the inside of one knee, pushing it back slightly, straight up, twist toward the arm in the air, reach for the ceiling. Look up at your fingertips. The other hand is sliding on the inside down towards your ankle. Good. And slowly return. The other one here, straight up. Twist. That open hand, fingers spread apart. Reach, reach. Good. And then there, arms drop and the feet back to a very closed position, pivoting on the heel and the ball of the foot. And then again, we grow two inches taller and the arms are crossed as you bring some of that weight forward, looking down at the floor, the knees open. The weight is on the outside of your foot, stretching in the ankles. Good, and then come up, nice and tall. And again, transfer the weight and stretch. Perfect, and there. So feet again to a nice starting position, uncross those arms and they're just dropped to the side. If you need the chair legs, use them, otherwise they're here. We're gonna shift to one side as this knee comes up, flex the foot, extend the leg and point and flex. Two, Two three, four, yeah, five, five thank you, six, six seven, eight, nine, Ten. Yeah. It comes right back to that place. So all you have to do is shift a little. Other one is up and out. One, two, three, four, five. five. Good. Six. Six. Working the seven, ankles. Eight, nine, ten. ten. And then take a deep breath. Exhale. A little lunging. So more of that leg needs to come off of the seat. So I'm going to come forward. Our feet are in a nice starting position. Now one comes forward with a bend in the knee and it's here, looking about two feet beyond your toes. Each time we come back to that position and it's a stretch, so please don't hit anyone. We did our, our space check and this is the third one. Now it slides to the side, open the hip, the arms are out and you wanna look slide it right never leaves the floor so it just slides across good job and comes back one more there to the front again it's a straight leg toes up and the arms reaching behind you like a little road runner tail feathers <laughs> yeah there good other side lunge forward flat back beautiful nice very there and one more open Slide it across, look. Don't you dare hit each other. <laughs> Smack, good. Open hand, the fingers spread apart, good. 
and then to the front, straight leg, toes up, and it's a flat back. And come up, and stretch, and one more, and there, good. That's a good stretch, all of them. So we're gonna take this position, we're gonna go to the sides. So now we have a chair leg in between our feet that are still nice and wide. Hold on with the inside hand to the frame of your chair. Outside arm and leg, opposite directions. Grab something, the hand becomes a fist. Bring it in, bring the leg in, round your back, tuck your chin, stretch out. From hip to toe, shoulder to fingertips. Good, curl up. So that outside arm reaches in front for something. The outside leg extends to the back and curl up. Sit tall, nice job. We swivel around. We need to have a little lazy Susan. <laughs> yeah, so our feet flat on the floor. Hold on. Outside arm reaches for something in front of you. Grab it. Bring it closer. Round the back. Go into a ball. Work your spine. Stretch it out again. Good. Ten. And curl up. One more. Reach for that chair, Dennis. Stretch out. Good. Grab it and pull in. And come on. Nice. I think that might be my favorite one. <laughs> um, I have a lot of favorite ones. So forward in the chair, again, back to a starting position, placing your hands on the chair. We're gonna keep those weights there for just a moment. We're gonna use our own weight. So balance yourself with wide feet. Hold on, look over a little bit and lift your fanny off the seat. It's One, up and down. Two, two three. three. Good job. Four. Four. Keep that upper body strong. Five. Six. six seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. ten. And now it closes. Feet together and the knees together. And a little forward in the chair. Hold on. Sit tall. And bring the knees to the chest and down. It's One, up. One. Two. Three. three good. Four. four five. five Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, and down. Separating the feet back to the starting position. If you're thirsty, water, stay hydrated. We're gonna work our shoulders, so today all we need is one weight. And we're gonna hold it horizontally, knuckles on top, and again, tall in the chair, chin off your chest. Find something to look at as you extend straight arms about that high. And down. Two. Two. And down. Three. Three. Four. Four. Loud. Five. Five. Yeah. Six. Six. Good. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. Ten. Awesome. Take a break. Stretch and breathe. Again, tall, chin off your chest, raise it, one, and down, two, three, there's that little pause, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, heavy little thing, isn't it? <laughs> all right, on the floor it goes, well, we're gonna swim. We're gonna go for a little swim today. So this is upper body stuff. Yeah, we're gonna do four different types. We're gonna do a breaststroke, and then we're gonna freestyle, and then, uh, no, I think just three, and a high dive. So start with that breaststroke. Your feet flat on the floor so that you're balanced in the chair, and then just reach forward. Yeah, two, let's do five. Three, four, and Five. Freestyle twist. One, two, two, a little three, slower. Four. This is three, a little <laughs> slower. This is four, <laughs> a little slower. This is last one. Good Five. job. Those arms behind and overhead, round the back, 
and dive, go down. Oh, good job, Mary. And then up and round the back, dive down, get as close to the floor as you can. Up and over, dive into it. Two more, stretch and dive. And last one, and there, and come on. Seems so nice in here a couple hours ago. It's kind of cold. <laughs> it's warm now. So sit tall. The arms are out from the shoulder for some toe touches in the air. It's one, one and, and two and thank you. Three and four and five and six and seven and eight and nine and ten. Into this position. Well, we need the weights again. Sorry. Yes, we need both of them. We're going to place them on our thighs. Well, actually, very close to the knee. An open hand, four fingers and the thumb resting on top. Sitting tall, extend a straight leg out. Looking forward, lift it up for ten. One, One two, two, three, four, four like your shirt. five, six, six seven, eight. eight. Nine, Nine, ten. ten. Now flex it up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Excellent. When you bring it back, bring it right back there. So we just shift a little. <coughs> Eyes off the floor. Lift it up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Toes up. One, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Perfect. And then, oh, we're done. We're done with these. You on the floor, on <laughs> for at least a while. No, we're done. So reach behind you if you're in class, and hopefully you've got that tennis ball somewhere close. And we're going to sit tall, warming up our hands and our feet. If you have shoes that come off quickly, you'll feel this when we get down to our feet. Balance begins at the bottom of your feet, so take care of them. And we're going to stretch the fingers, working that ball. You need one? Okay. Good posture, a soft fist where that rest straight out, bring it close, and then straight out, halfway back, place it in the other fist, so your eye on the ball. Both arms out, the hands close to each other, where you can transfer that from one fist to the other. And then placing it on the floor to wake up your feet. Remember, that's where your balance starts at the bottom of your feet. So one, two, three, four, four people without their shoes on. That's good. Push down and roll, and then roll it over to the other side. I'm so used to you doing that, but no, not today. I know it's colder, so you had to wear socks. <laughs> it's not triple digits. <laughs> so you're going to push down and roll, stimulating the bottom of your feet. So let's pick it up, and we're done. So back into the chair it goes, and we go back into the chair as well. So back where the seat meets the back, your feet flat on the floor, including the heel, and slightly behind the knees, engaging those abdominal muscles, sealing up any space behind you. And then maybe your hands are here. Arch your back, and then press. Good. Again, arch your back, and then press. Pressing into the chair, looking forward, the legs straight out, the feet off the floor, draw a perfect One, circle. Two, three, three four, four, 
Eventually, you'll get there. It takes a while. Take some practice. Out to the edge. I don't know. At least halfway, right? Something like that. Arms across, the chin off your chest, the feet gorilla glued to the floor. Lean back, get real close, but don't touch the chair. Two, three, four. <laughs> Five. Bob's like, I'm counting because I know she won't. <laughs> Lean back. Two, three, in charge. four, five. And all the way up. Again, lean back. Two, Two three, four, five. Four. Two, three, four, five. Last one. Held a little longer. Four. Two, Two, three, three, four. four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Oh, all right, great job, thank you. Your hands here, a nice flat back. Transfer some weight over your thighs and knees. Reaching from the hip, looking down, like if you had a mirror on the floor, you were looking at yourself, okay? And then lift a heel, lift the other heel, drop the first heel, second heel. So it's up, up. Down, down, up, up, down, down. One more. Up, up, up down, down. Just down. heels. Up, up and down. down. Up, up and down. down. One more. Up, down. Nose over toes, right? You know? And if they're not, bring these feet back a few inches. Reaching from the hip, looking down at that reflection. Weight placed on the ball of the foot as you come out of the chair and up. Bend at the knee, the weight is in the heel, back into the chair, beautiful job. So get used to transferring your weight, nose over toes, and standing tall, looking forward, beautiful job. The knees, they bend slightly, you know the chair is there, the weight is in the heel, back into the chair. Two more, here and up. Great job, Dennis, yes. And back into it. Oh, one more. Yeah, like you're about to make a speech. So you stand tall. And then you bend those knees back into the chair. And sometimes I see this, but no, all the way up. Shoulders over hips, good. The hands are here. The elbows stretch to the side. Twist, take a good look at the wall. Again. And now knee to opposite elbow. One, and ten, up. Good. Two. two. And ten, lift. Three. three and ten, up. Four. And ten, up. One more. Five. five. Ooh, great job. I'll walk. No, I'm just now we need the large ball. All oh, those little black bugs are still with us. Nice. All right. Allowing <coughs> space behind you, sitting more forward in the chair, but tall. So we're going to hold it. <coughs> so place it. Drop the elbows. Extend the arms. You should be focused on, on the rim of the ball. Arms right out from the shoulder. Transfer the weight over your thighs. The arms don't drop, they just reach forward. As far as you can go. Good, and hold. Two, Two three, three, four, five. five. Come up, the arms extend overhead, and then <coughs> lean back and hold. Two, Two three, three, four, five. five. Great job. Again, sitting tall, drop it. You're gonna keep your eye on the ball as you twist her torso. That back arm just keeps pulling and hold. Two, Two three, three, four, five. five. And then center. Go to the other side as far as you can go on this side and hold. Two, Two three, three, four, five. five. Again, here, placing it on the chest, elbows drop. 
and squeeze hard. It works just as well that way. Absolutely. Yeah. And relax. Great. That space that we kept here, that's where the ball will be. So make sure that you've got a lot of that leg off of the seat. The ball nowhere near the knee, but on the inner thigh. Yeah, and the hands now on top. The feet come together. Perfect. And then squeeze hard. You have no one to blame but yourself on this one. <laughs> Not me. All right, relax. Again, make sure your feet are together and you're sitting tall as you squeeze that ball and hold, hold it. Keep the same amount of tension on it. Yeah, mine are very much fatigued from doing it yesterday as well. <laughs> and relax, great job. Hold the ball, separate the feet and we are going to get out of the chair we're not going to use this again so maybe put it somewhere where it won't be in your way transferring the weight again nose over toes come all the way up never ever be in a hurry might feel a little awkward or uneasy so take your time we'll be standing to the back of the chair raising heels and toes oh my look at this Okay, <laughs> arms distance from the chair back. Using it if you need it, if you don't, they're here, or maybe just one hand. Up, down, good. Up, working to strengthen your ankles. Four, nice, pat. Five, Five. eyes off the floor. Six, Six. smiles are optional. Seven. Seven. Eight. Eight. We're going to hold on. Ten. Nine. Nine. So go up. Get your balance Ten. and focus forward, not on the floor. Good. And then they come back to this position. The weight is in the heel. Up, down. Who's Two. Good at that? Three. Three. Four. Five. five yes. Six. six seven, seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. ten. Trudy, you okay? Yeah, I just like it. Okay, you need anything? No. Okay, I'm gonna turn just a little bit so that you can see it, but you guys know what this is. So our feet again, shoulders, hips, and heels, looking forward. The leg on one side bears most of the weight as this extends to the back. Straight leg lift, so it's up. One, two, two good. Three, three four, five, six, six seven, seven, eight, nine, Keep it to the back, bending that standing knee, the heel to the floor. Good. And come up, bring it forward, shift to the other side, eyes off the floor as it's up, One, down. Two, two three, four, five, five just stay there. Three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. ten. Bend and sit into that stretch. Oh, that feels good. Nice. And come up. Bringing that forward. Do we have any runners? I never like to run. Nobody else? Runners? No? Okay. Ha. All right. We're going to shift some side to side, doing some kicks to the back. So don't kick anything. It's one. one and, and you got clearance. Two. two and, and three. three and, and four. four. One more on each side. Five, Great ten. job. And now we come to the side of the chair. Body on the same plane as the frame, so the weight will shift to the inside leg. The hand is here. Slide this forward. Ten straight leg lifts. Eyes off the floor. So it's up. One, two, two good. Three, three four, four. Thank you. Five, five six, six, seven. Eight, nine, nine ten. ten. Bend the knee and lift it up and down. Two, Two three, three, perfect. Four, four one more. Five. five. And we come back to that position where we need to go to the other side. 
better? Yes. Water? Um, no. Do you have any water? No. Sue, there should be some right on the t uh, desk right out there. Would, do you mind? Thank you. Okay. So your feet wide, the weight shifts to that inside leg, the hand placed on the chair. Slide this forward, but don't look down. Yeah. And lift it up. Thank you. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight, nine, nine ten. ten. Lift it up, down, two, two three, four, four, and one more. Five. five. Thank you, so. Oh, yeah. Take a break. We're going to do a little balance, so I don't really think you need this one. Just balance. Okay. The balance is rock the boat. So we're going to be standing to the back of the chair. And if you need this, use it. If you don't, they're here. Eyes off the floor as you shift your weight from one leg to the other leg. Yeah, like you're just kind of swaying to the music. Your feet never leave the floor. Okay, until now. <laughs> so maybe place those hands on the back of the chair shifting to one side this other foot that has no weight on it comes close to the standing leg and it's cocked so the weight is somewhat on the ball of the foot and then step to the side and do the same thing place it close maybe one hand drops the eyes off the floor good and there so remember your head has weight to it so it's not directly on top of your shoulders and forward it's going to cause you to come forward with the rest of your body. So stand tall. And let's do that one more time. There and there. So everyone's hands on the chair. As you step to the side, and now it lifts off the floor. It's a one-legged stand. Good job. And then down as you shift. And maybe the hands just hover over the back of the chair. And they're there if you need it. Good. Super. Let's try that going forward. So standing to the side of the chair, again, your body in line with the frame, the weight on the inside leg, hand on there. Take a split step or take a step forward with the outside foot. Yeah. And then find center. You're not too far back or forward. And the arms dropped. Yeah. And then just come forward and back. Yeah, just a little bit forward and back. Be mindful of where that weight is on your feet. When you come forward, the back heel doesn't come up. When you lean back, the toes don't lift. Not yet anyway. So it's just there. Just a little bit. And then keep your hand, inside hand, on that chair. Lean back so that this outside foot is flexed. Toes up. Put it down as you shift forward. The inside back heel is lifted. Lean back, toes up, lean forward, heel up. Again, there and there. Good job. And then back to a neutral position where it's both flat. We go to the other side and do the same thing. So we stand to the side, the weight placed on that inside leg, the hand on the chair. Find something to look at in front of you and then take a step forward with the outside foot. Yeah, just like you're gonna walk away. Ah, oh, got stuck. So you're right there. And then you're gonna lean forward and back just a little bit. Yeah, I always think of having like a retractable dog leash. Someone pulls <laughs> me and then they let go. Ah, then they come back. <laughs> this is how my mind works, okay? Yeah. And then keep your hand on the chair, lean forward a little bit more, that inside back heel lifts. Lean back, the toes lift. Forward, heel, back, toes. And then rock. Yeah, good job, all right. A practice in balance and a practice in weight shift. So um, we're gonna, is that wrong? 
empty. It's empty, okay. I don't know what's happening at your house, but we're gonna do a little cardio. And if you wanna sit in the chair and keep in motion, go ahead. If you stand beside it, just keep moving. So if somebody asked you your name, you were going, Dennis. <laughs> Dennis. Yeah, so you should be on the top a little bit. Let me turn this one the other way down. Sure, pick on me, because I'm all by myself. <laughs> yes. Oh, yeah. Yes. Um, yeah. I love you. All right, so come forward. Make sure that you have that room behind you. One weight in your hands, plural. And then we're almost done. So sit tall, wrap the fingers and the arms. They're stretched overhead. Reach forward from the hip, it's a flat back. Drop it 
and raise them up. high. Good. Two. Two. And shout Five. it out. Three. Three. Up. up. Four. Four. Up. Raise them. Five. Five. Up. Six. Six. Up. Seven. Seven. Up. Eight. Eight. Up. Nine. Up. Ten. Last one. Up. Great job. And we place them on the floor for a cool down. <coughs>